Well, Doctor, I'm also curious to ask you, yeah. uh, well, in terms of, uh, well, Lifestyle. Uh, well, okay, mm. well, in terms of lifestyle and yeah. also symptoms, right? Now, many of us lead a, uh, well, a lifestyle, a Malaysian lifestyle. Yeah. We love our Quite food. sedentary. Right, we, we love say. our food, sedentary. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now, in terms of uh, people that you mentioned who are walking <coughs> around oblivious of their, uh, well, blood pressure, perhaps um, what kind of symptoms would you ask them to look out for? <coughs> One of the problems we have with high blood pressure or hypertension is that most patients have no symptoms. And that's why we still have 60% of patients in Malaysia undetected. Mm -hmm. Because people who develop symptoms, um, they will go for a check. Whereas people who don't, normally don't. Okay? And there is a problem in Malaysia that a lot of people um, would rather not know. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah? you know. Encouraging people to go for medical checkouts is difficult, you know. Um, even where, for example, companies pay for them to have an annual medical checkup, the take-up rate is actually quite poor mm. because a lot of Malaysians would rather not know. Mm. Those who develop symptoms are probably the lucky ones, okay, because they develop symptoms and then they go for a checkup. Mm -hmm. And the symptoms to look out for, for example, headaches, okay, okay, a lot of people get headaches, shortness of breath, undue shortness of breath, okay, um, double vision, blurring of your vision, mm -hmm. all these are warning signs okay? okay particularly you develop headaches at the back here in the nape of the neck right. that's very very um significant mm -hmm. um so these are the symptoms they can look out for but like i said most of them have no symptoms right so if you have no symptoms then that's where we encourage you to go and get your blood pressure checked right. mm. now you're like a walking time bomb well you are yeah. i mean if you are 35 years and above in malaysia mm -hmm. you should check your blood pressure at least once a year Mm, I would probably go younger than that now. Yes. Because every, the disease process is getting younger and younger. Right. Yeah. I mm. think if you wanted to follow a, a practical way of doing it, you can't can measure your waist, mm -hmm. as we discussed just now, right? Yeah. All you need is a tape measure. You can yes. do it at home, yep. in the privacy of your room. <laughs> okay? Now, if you find that your waist are above, or is above the mm. limits that we set, 80 centimeters, 31 and a half inches for women, mm -hmm. yep. 90 centimeters, 35 and a half inches for men, all right, then you really need to have your blood pressure checked, your blood sugar checked, your cholesterol levels checked, all right? Okay. Because when you have obesity, mm -hmm. right, you tend to have all the other problems the as other well. One, yep. Hypertension, mm -hmm. diabetes, high cholesterol, right. and all these will lead to, lead to strokes and heart attacks. Mm. Mm. It's like a package. Unfortunately, yes. not a package that you want. Okay, now doctor, well, since we're running short of time, well, as a spokesperson, as a representative uh, of the health department, speaking about World Hypertension Day, do you have a message for Malaysians out there yeah. to be aware of their health when it comes mm -hmm. to their blood pressure? Right. Um, I think what we would like to see, uh, what we'd like to see is this. We would like to see Malaysians, number one, getting their blood pressure checked because we are 60% still undiagnosed. Mm. Um, the second thing we would like to see is that we would like to see Malaysians leading a mo much healthier lifestyle. Watching your diet, exercising more, so that you can prevent all these diseases, particularly hypertension. Yeah. I think that's the urgent message. We need to get this message out. Be more active. Check yeah. your blood pressure, that's right. even though you feel well. Mm -hmm. you know, right. Because otherwise, you can't get it treated. Mm -hmm. Remember in Malaysia, right? every day, there are six new patients admitted with a stroke to hospitals in Malaysia wow. every single day. Every single day. And most of them have high blood pressure not detected before. Okay. okay. Right. So you right. need it's a to great get situation checked. there. Yep. Okay. Thank well. you very much. Thank doctor. you very much, Doctor. And yes, we hope that you've been enlightened by this uh, situation, uh, what's happening in Malaysia. World Hypertension Day, which happened last Monday. So be sure to monitor your, well, how should I say, measurements mm -hmm. in and out. <laughs> and of course, uh, be active. Uh, we'd like to thank uh, Dr. Azani again. Thank you so much. Yeah. We shall have you again, hopefully, Definitely. sometime soon.